Even if Bola Tinumbu is on a wheelchair, he will continue to insist that he must be president, said Daily Muhammadu. Hello everyone, welcome to Newsport TV. A spokesman of the People's Democratic Party Presidential Campaign Council, Chief Dele Momodu has described the presidential candidate of the All Progressive Congress as someone who is desperate for power. Speaking during an exclusive interview session, he wondered why Bola Tinumbu is still insisting on contesting even when he knows that he is not physically fit for the position. Even when he's on a wheelchair, Dele Momodu believes that Tinumbu will still be insisting on the presidency, he said. Tinumbu, I'm sorry, due to no fault of his, is physically unfit. Anybody can be sick, so I'm not trying to disparage him. If you're sick, you're sick. If you're weak, you're weak. But you know, for Tinumbu, politics is his life. Politics is his blood. So he's not going to agree. Even if he's on a wheelchair, I'm sure he will continue to insist that he must be president of Nigeria. And that's very unfortunate. I place Nigeria above friendship. If I felt he had the capacity physically, mentally and otherwise to run Nigeria, I would support him. Now let's take some comments. First commenter said, Daily Momodu will be on wheelchair unless Tinumbu had not insisted, assisted you with money and his wife Oluremi in the past, time past. Alate Nuje, psychophant. Another said, only truth is bitter. Another person said, I have said it times without numbers that Shetima is playing along because he wants to take over the leadership of our beloved country through the back door, but God will never permit it. All their pranks are known to us. It can never work. Our hope is on INEC to do the needful when they start with their manipulations. Nigerians are waiting. He is too desperate to rule us. He knows this is the only chance he has because of ill health and age is no longer on his side. Another person said, everyone knows the fact that Tinumbu wants to be president for selfish reasons and is not thinking Nigeria, so only the sensible ones will understand that. Another person said, truth is too bitter, only a few can swallow it. Another person said, Daily Momodu, you are blessed only the people with dull brains that will support APC and their evil hunger agenda imposed on innocent Nigerians. Another person said, imagine a clueless and senseless stock from a mentally derailed and imported Yoruba man. And if you check him medically, you'll be marveled at the type of ailment and terminal diseases he is aboring in his, in his fat body. But I'm sure God will surprise him and all his associates and Sinobu will rule over them. That time they will come back to Sinobu and rub their useless mouth on the ground before him. Another person said, you that is not on a wheelchair, why didn't you contest Olodo? Another said, Tinumbu will disgrace the good Yoruba race and even Nigeria if he is voted for president. Another person said, and unfortunately it will not be. Another person said, Dele Momodu, are you not acting like an ingrate? Another person said, Alhamdulillah, is the not office of the president oh is a God lot of work. And anybody who amazement. we are opening our eyes for him to Another go into said, that role must be your meant to be fit better than to perform status, status, number one. Why you couldn't two, plan your life well, living life by relocating your family is to spending in pounds about when your income is in Naira? Where is ovation today? Health is now, not be only to get something big that everybody really has control over. Another person said, bit, even if Tinumbu is his way, he will insist on any local. Doing his things. A lot of people that don't come self across as being ill. Okay, so these are some of the comments. What they are nursing in their body that trail be terminal. What did the mom do say? But if they don't tell anyone, and honestly, one thing that has been a lot of debate people might not realize is the health status to of the medical the history. Labiera. So, for the mom to say this, a lot of people have been always a cause for discussion. Back at him to and say, honestly, without um, being sentimental, sometimes it passes what you um, people will say. Where Bele face, you know, there was a time it would be for you, there will be time it will be against you. And as a spokesperson for um, Atiku Abubakar, of course, he'll be punching holes in his opposition, major opposition. And um, so this is what we found ourselves to be. 
but we just want a better Nigeria because all our leaders have failed us woefully without missing words for us to find ourselves where we are in today. They've not done the Nigerians well. They've not done our children's children well. And honestly, it's quite scary. It's quite scary that, you know, even the most patriotic of us are somehow losing faith in this beautiful entity called Nigeria, a country that has the power to be the very best in the world, a country that is blessed with human and natural resources, but cursed, heavily cursed with horrible, bad, unpatriotic, inhumane leaders who are always, always after their own pockets to siphon money for their children and for their children's children without the singlest consideration for their fellow human being. We just hope that we get a better Nigeria because all our elders and political elites should just cover their faces in shame because you've not done Nigeria good. Our children are hungry on the streets. No care. Our first lady... Our first ladies, both states, local government level, gone are the days where they play complementary roles and they move to the grassroots and are connected. But what we have, even local government chairman do not live in the area of their jurisdiction. They choose to live in the elitist part of town without consideration of the fact that one day, just one day, they will be off that seat. And all the people drumming and currying their fave flavor will just disappear. But their good deeds is what in the will book keep them of, in the history of Nigeria. Minds. Thank you very Us much for watching. Remember to history. like, share and subscribe. May God bless Nigeria. We believe Nigeria will work again. See you in the next news. Bye for now.